Hello viewers, this is Dow Too Fast here. If you work on cars a lot, you know many of the trims and panels in your car are held in with plastic clips and fasteners. Even the bumpers are held on with mostly clips and a couple of screws. You know after removing those clips a bunch of times and with age, they often will break. When that happens, there's really no easy way to secure those panels or your bumper. In this video, I will show you a very handy kit you can get which can really help you in those situations. And it's a 415 piece retaining clip and fastener kit that you can pick up for only $21. So let me show you this retaining clip and fastener kit from the company Presiva. Here's a look at everything you get with this kit. At the front, we have these nylon fasteners. And with these, you plug this end into your vehicle. And then, this is a tie wrap you can use to tie wrap the wiring harness. You get 10 of these. In this bag are foam pads that you can place onto the retaining clip. And this will prevent any vibration it comes with four plastic pry bars, and these typically retail for around eight to ten dollars. You also get a metal pry bar, and this is also probably five six dollars. Now let's look at these retaining clips in this box. As you can see, they're neatly organized in this storage case. As you can see, this kit comes with four hundred fifteen pieces of retainer clips. Also, on this sheet of paper, it tells you all the different clips it comes with and the dimension of these clips. Let me put up a screenshot of this so you can see it better. If you count every type of clips here, there are a total of 18 different styles. And the nice thing about it is what you see here on this diagram is exactly what is placed in these bins. And this makes so much sense because if you're looking for a clip with a specific dimension on the diagram, you should need to guess which one it is in these bins. Now according to the manufacturer, these clips you see here are commonly used by Ford, Chrysler, Toyota, Mazda, Honda, and Suzuki. So for example, these clips are commonly used on door panels. These ones here are used on interior pieces for panels or carpeting. And these ones with a push pin are commonly used in the engine bay or bumper. Now one thing to note is if you're trying to replace a factory clip that's broken, you might not find one that looks exactly the same in this kit here. But what you can do is look up the dimension of the clip, how long it is, and you can match up to something that's close to the original clip, and then you can use these clips to replace a broken one. Now you can get this entire kit on Amazon for $21, which is an awesome deal. And I'll include the link in the description below. I hope you enjoy watching this video, and don't forget to click on a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.